Hi there, today I'm going to show you my method for covering over the raised head which is important when, when you want to uh, record onto your looping tapes. Obviously these looping tapes uh, record one continuous loop and if you don't cover over the raised head then you'll get sort of like a half second gap in, in the audio which isn't ideal so we need to cover over the raised head. Now the raised head is this little bit just to the left of the player head and when you press record that erases the tape as, as it goes round because there's a small gap here when you press stop there's going to be just a half second of of audio that isn't recorded so we need to do something to cover this over now what you can do is that you can actually tape over this erase head or put a little bit of tin foil uh, I've tried that in the past and if you've got an expensive recorder or a recorder you really like then you don't really want to be covering this over and on some recorders it's actually erased even when I have covered this over. So my method just involves masking tape and a pair of scissors or painter's tape depending on where you live. So all you do is just uh, cut a bit off there and then you need to cut three smaller bits now these bits are going to be around about the width of the the opening in your cassette so we need to cover this bit over so just a little bit under that 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 opening so, cut three of those. And then all we do is we get the big bit of tape on the sticky side. Stick, sticky side to sticky side. Around about in the middle. Try and get it as straight as you can. I was sticking three bits down because that's going to form a nice little barrier between the raised head and the tape. So, three bits stuck down like that. And then all you do is you get your scissors, cut one bit off, and then the other. And now you've got a little, a little strip. And this side is non-stick, that's gonna to be touching the tape on the other side is non-stick and that's going to be touching the erase head but we've still got two sticky bits here and they're going to cover over the tape they're going to stick onto the tape sorry so this is one of my uh, looping tapes that, that I've made so what you do is you just stick it to the tape there just push it in a bit and then stick it down onto the other side so we'll do a quick demonstration of a recording. Okay, so for the recording, I've got my trusty MC202. My father gave me this, a man who obviously knows how to party. So we'll just start this rolling. Start it recording. We'll play something. <laughs> See how that sounds. So you can see how there's no gap in the audio now and it's uh, one complete loop. Okay, thanks for thanks for listening and watching. If you like what you see, please subscribe or like my Instagram. 
Cheers. Bye.